Welcome to Great Escapes Chestnut Bay RV Resort in Leesburg, Alabama. Upon arrival, you may find it difficult to turn in with long trailers of 40 feet or more. Notice how close my sister and brother-in-law's 43-foot camper came from scraping. Man, I looked back and I was like, oh shoot, there's a yellow pole there. And I was like, hug him. Yeah. Yeah. Holy. Oh my gosh. Maybe we go in back. Maybe we could go over there about four. Oh my Holy crap! Oh, that, uh, that was Ty. That was Ty. That yeah. Was <laughs> All right, we're at Chestnut Bay. About to go take a walk around, see what uh, what's around here. Pirates Bay Water Park is in the center of the RV resort, and was the major draw for us to come here. I had to come here to check it out with my love of water parks. Guests of the water park not staying at the RV resort have special parking, but can walk into the RV areas. You have to sign a waiver form to enter the water park, removing all liability of Pirates Bay for any injury you may sustain while in the park. There are more than one way to stay at the Great Escapes in Leesburg, Alabama. The RV Resort, of course, cabins at the RV Resort, and across the street you have rental homes, which you can easily access from the RV Resort through a tunnel under Road 147. The RV Resort guests have full access of the pools, beach, canoes, kayaks, and other beach items when you wear the Resort Guest Bracelet, which most of the time we forgot to wear and no one even noticed. What are we doing? We're gonna get this kayak right. I mean, this canoe. We're gonna just paddle around right here and see how it goes. All right. And see, the way it works is, look, the pedals are opposite. You see, uh -huh. they're twisted. So yes. You got a blade on each side, so you're gonna paddle like this. Okay? Yeah. The I'm gonna way paddle the cup just is. like that. Except yeah. the guy in the back. You're gonna steer. He's the guider. Okay. He's, the, he's your rudder back here. So what's the one in the middle do? Nothing. Sit I just sit and enjoy the ride. <laughs> Get ready. Yeah, get ready. Oh, get God. Ready. Oh, turn us into Oh, God, y'all. There we go. Get a little action. <laughs>
Oh, okay. Hey, John, you're not in the shot. Where are you at? Where are you at? There you are. Hey, hey, I scream. There you go. We scream, you scream. We all scream for ice cream. It's good. It was good. James did good. It was good. Chocolate, frosty. Oh, yeah. We don't need a gallon and a half. Well, we're going to go try to see if we can find us some tickets for the water park. May not be able to get in. Said it was sold out online. We're going to go find out. You good with me? Yeah. All right, we got our tickets. We good. We in. Yeah, we, we on. We, no, it's weird. It's weird because we went online and they were all sold out. So I, I guess. Uh, I all right, so we're gonna go take a tour up here. We're gonna see what's. Good morning. Good morning. morning. Good. Time How to go, you? ain't it? Yeah. Already bright and early. It was tough for the campers yeah. to get up. So this there, used though. to be this was camping the RV. spaces. This and used to be RV spaces, and now you could have backed done. in. They made these little and had this view of cabins and they have a nice view of the lake in the background it'd been tough to get in here though you yeah. couldn't got in here with ours yeah Ain't no way you back we barely could get in where we were yeah you can't back into this that's cute up in there ain't it Kind yeah. of set up in there in its own little. Mm -hmm. Now that yeah, they. Yeah, they have totally. Parking. That's what I'm saying. You got a little screen porch outside. No, no that's, that's on the other one. one. Okay. This is this is brand new because yeah, this is new. I, See, when I looked new, on the, this is old. When I looked on Google, that's old. This right was there. this was a camp. This was RV sites. Yeah. What's down that way? These are newer. You can tell they're still yeah. muddy. It ain't even. Yeah. And you got the plumbing hooked up on that one. They're little, they're little trailers. Yeah, they have they a little trailer in here. And then, yeah. Roll yeah. them in and... Yeah. Pretty cool. See right here, little porch off the back. Uh -huh, that's nice. Yeah. That's not nice view. Yeah. And then this is the view you get. Uh -huh. Wow. Yeah, that was probably pretty nice before when it was camping. Yeah. But it's probably, it probably risky to back the camper. Yeah. yeah. Right there. Right there oh, and stop. Right. Uh -huh. You know, next thing you know, the camper's down here. Yeah, the yeah. wheel gets off the ground yeah. and it yeah. tumbles down. Yeah. That's exactly what happened. They built a little additional deck on that one. Yep. Yeah. Little decks. Huh. So look, they got a little, little obstacle bank. course. This used to be zip line. Oh. And it, he, he was telling me. Mm -hmm. And so now they, they made it into a They used to have a, little, a zip line course here and they took it down. Yeah. Now they got like a little, like a little bridge. suspension bridge. Yeah, he said it was zip line and he said, you know, it, they came here last year and the zip line was open. Mm -hmm. And this year they've closed it. He said something happened. Yeah, mm -hmm. got hurt. Yeah, see, I came in right here and here. This is where it almost got my rear. Yeah. Because yeah. I it's knew when I hit low. this little bump right here, uh -huh. I was worried about it. Yeah. I thought about it. Yeah, now, I should have swung over here. Yeah, and got wide and come wide. this way. Yeah, but see, we barely saw the sign. We come around mm -hmm. that curve, and Karen's like, "It's right there." Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I knew you were behind me. I'm yeah, like, Shit, we gotta get in. I mean, yeah, yeah. Great escapes. Great escapes. So it's called Great Escapes, Great escapes. at Chesapeake Bay. Yeah, Chestnut Bay. Chestnut Bay. Resorts. Yeah, yeah. Great escapes. Chestnut Resorts, Bay. Yeah. yeah. Oh, here comes the golf course. And I thought it was called something else. Well, the water park's Pirates Bay. Yeah. It's Chestnut Bay, yeah. so everybody keeps calling it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. This is just Great Escapes. This well, is Great Escapes, I think. Let's have, have multiple yeah. places. Yeah. And this yeah. is just this is their the Chestnut, Chestnut Bay. Bay. Yeah. Right. Yeah.
After we left the water park, we took a little tour at the upper sites in the 200s. In our assessment, we feel these would be a better RV site with more room between campers, larger pads, and better space for RV maneuvers. There is also a pool with a water slide up here, along with a playground. Our water park rating for Pirates Bay is a 5 out of 10. I want to give Pirates Bay at least an 8, but I have observed some issues resulting in a 5. The Thunder Bowl is the main attraction here, but had a serious deficiency. You can see the brown stains on the ride in the background here, where repainting is in dire need. More importantly, the surface is rough, causing some riders to get stuck where you are then requested to just stand up and get moving. <laughs> yes, <sir. laughs> hey! Stand up! The major deficiency to this ride is not that. It's the bad paint peel in the exit tube. This bad paint pill is visual when the video is paused. This is where Ron received his injury. Of course, it was not until I watched the video to see where the injury occurred. If your arm is not tucked in during the exit tube, you can scrape this paint pill area, causing injury. This is a major deficiency in my book. I also observed other slides with paint pill as well. And then they got some super slide that ends down here. All rides seem to be operating properly, it just appeared that they are in need of repainting. I'm not sure about what we can't see, but what we can see is paint failure. But don't let this be a deterring factor. Pirate's Bay is a good water park with five good thrill slides. The $20 entry fee makes this a great deal. The water park has the potential to be a great water park if they would spend a little time in maintenance. Maybe the lack of maintenance is why you sign a waiver to enter the water park. I've never been to a water park anywhere where I had to sign a waiver form removing the water park from any liability to my injury. Could this be a lack of proper insurance coverage, a lack of lifeguards, lack of training, or a little of all three? All in all, this water park does make a good family activity while camping. I'm just a little disappointed in the proper maintenance and care. I'm sure we are not the only ones that notice this. Inside, inside that, uh, toilet bowl. The, the walls are like that. Yeah. Oh, oh. Uh, you my high, huh? <laughs> <laughs> That guy says you need stitches. He did tell him that. I said, well, I'll just band-aid it and hope it dries up. Y'all got to talk this one? Sure. All right. All right, we're going into the pool. Tanya, where are you going? <laughs> oh, she's getting pictures. Getting pictures of the camper. All right, Tanya, go ahead. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Yeah. All right, we 
are piled on this. And we are maxed out. You can do all kinds of oh, Adam, all right, everybody. Next thing you know, you Who's got up front there? Who's up front? <laughs> look, look at us. I've got Python hand on up here at the top. <laughs> we have got six people on this boat. Yep. We are filled to capacity. We will pop a willy today. Let's <laughs> 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 honk it in here. Honk it in. Honk. Woohoo! Uh oh, here comes the police. Here comes the police. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say y'all got too many people on that. <laughs> you, you making too much. See, the police, the police has called us. Mike will be on me. That's in a right. That's right. You <laughs> gotta cut it. I, I, I was waiting on the blue line. If I had one, buddy, I'd have yeah, got you. You nailed me with your mic. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thank you. Hey, Mike. <laughs> Oh, that was funny. I got that all on camera. Did you? Yeah. <laughs> I got it all on camera. The area restaurants around Chestnut Bay are not in short supply. The restaurant we chose was Dex and Docks. This restaurant really fits in with the lake atmosphere and made a great choice while camping on Lake Wise. Our price to taste value is good. You get a good taste without spending too much with the added benefit of great lake atmosphere. The open air atmosphere gives you a true sense of eating in nature. I could see this restaurant not getting the same great review if it was pouring rain, so plan your trip accordingly to the weather. This is the typical bar food menu with burgers, wings, and seafood. A couple can eat here under $50 and it all depends on what you get, but this gives you a good baseline. Now for the Glamp Ratings, Big Rig Access, 3 stars. Any RV over 43 feet may have issues getting into the park. Ron and Karen have a 43 foot fifth wheel and was able to get in barely. Site quality, 4 stars. The site was clean and well maintained, 4 stars due to being gravel when it could be paved. Cleanliness of the entire campground, four stars. Everything was clean, but dropped a star for the water park, needing some maintenance. Noise, three stars. The water park can make some noise from the site we were in, especially during the peak capacity times. The 200s on top of the hill may experience lesser noise. Campground internet, four stars. Speeds were decent, but could be faster, we had no issues. Cable TV, zero stars, because they don't have cable TV. Over the air TV, one star. Over the air TV, not gonna work well at this park. The worst part of the trip is the packing up and getting ready to go home, isn't it? If you do come to this campground, it's very tight for big campers. We have a 40 foot camper and we're going to try to figure out how to get out of here. I wish you had gotten that. I small. just really don't know about how we're pulling out of this because the way this pull through is angled, it's not really accommodating for a large fifth wheel. No, 
we should have went up in the 200s up on top of the hill behind this where the swim pool is because back there the spaces that right. would be a lot easier to get yeah. in and out of right. these these pull throughs i think these pull throughs are probably going to be tougher to pull out of than the back ends okay so here comes the tractor with the uh the kids on it and parents and whatnot doing a little tractor ride so that's kind of cool so you can see them going by see them going by there so they got that and then like i say up here on the hill this swimming pool area up here they're going to convert that to a um, indoor pool uh, eventually because they're going to try to make this a year-round park currently this is not a year-round park this is a park that is only here for uh summer months and uh hey, hey you're on camera you on camera Hi. oh we got simon right here yep, i didn't even notice Simon. i'm sorry i'm taking your seat bud he, it, he has he has learned that uh, sitting on this couch right here is just a great viewpoint for everything. He just sits up here and watches. Annie, she... Uh, stays in the closet. Stays in the closet, but right now she's hunting flies. She's our she's our hunting kitty, and Simon's the eating kitty. You can tell. Here comes, here comes the little predator right now. Hey, Annie. There's the predator in action. Looking for them fly. Hey, here's a fly over here. Hey, come on, Annie, kitty. Annie, here's a fly over here. Come on, Get it, girl. Get it. Get it, girl. Get it, girl. Get it. So, and then Simon's our eating cat. You can tell because he's a big one. And he's a small one. Andy, Andy kills the prey and Simon eats it. Yeah. He's ate a couple flies, truly. He's ate a couple flies, a couple gnats. He's a good exterminator, but these flies are just too much for the exterminator to keep up on, ain't it, Simon? Boy. Go get him, boy. He tries. He get. He got a couple of them. He'll get. He'll get a couple of them. Well, there they are. Simon and Annie show. And that is our glamp review of Great Escapes Chestnut Bay RV Resort in Leesburg, Alabama. Tune in almost every Thursday at six o'clock for new content. Now be sure to subscribe, then like and share. Uh, tell your friends about us. I'm James. Hi, I'm Tanya. And this is our Glamp review of Great Escapes. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> That's <some> good bloopers. <laughs> it ain't on purpose. Hi, I'm James. Hi, I'm Tanya. And this is our Glamp review of Great Escapes. Come on. <laughs> Hi, I'm Tanya. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> My mind. Keep going. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> all right, all right, let's try this again. Are you ready? Ha! Oh, wait, you can't do it. Yeah, quit laughing. <laughs> oh, God, okay. We're not professionals. <laughs> we, we, we're not. Thank you for watching. Now, check out these videos.